name is Selena, and I'm here to do a review on Saga Volume 2 by Brian K. Vaughn and illustrated by Fiona Staple. So Saga is a graphic novel for a mature audience, and this is the sequel, and it picks right up from where Volume 1 leaves off. Um, so if you follow the graphic novels, I think the Volume 2 is numbers 7 through 12, but don't quote me on that. Uh, I've only read it in this format, so I read Volume 1, and then now Volume 2, and then Volume 3 is due to come out sometime in April. In Volume 2, you learn um, about a couple of different things. One, you learn about Marco's parents, Hazel's grandparents. Then you also learn about Gwendolyn, Marco's ex. We also get to know a little bit more about how Marco and Alana fell in love. So these are also introducing new characters to us. So Marco's parents are Clara, I believe I'm saying that right, and Barr. So Clara is Marco's mother and she is hot-headed and she is more likely to wield an axe or a sword and arm herself for battle than to stay at home and bake cookies kind of mom. Um, so she is an interesting foil to um, to Marco's pacifism. Then there's Barr, who is seems who seems somewhat more domestic than his wife. He makes clothes for the family, um, and he stays behind while his wife charges off to help Marco find Isabella when they banished her um, at the end of Volume One. Marco's father seems to be someone who just kind of wants to have a happy family, and he also has his secret as well. So we also learn about how Marco and Alana meet, and um, some of the circumstances surrounding that. So we already knew that Alana was reading this book by D. Oswald Heist, and that book seemed to have had an impact on her, and so now we actually get to see what that book influenced and inspired in their relationship. So Marco and Alana basically fell in love over reading, and I love that. Um, Alana is someone who enjoys reading and just wanted someone to share her reading with, and so only one who was willing to listen, I guess, was Marco, while he happened to have been a prisoner um, of war. You get to meet Oswald Heist toward, toward the end of the story. As someone who likes to read, to have that sort of interaction with your author is something that I would love to have. Um, be able to meet an author that has influenced you. Another new character that we meet is Gwendolyn, who is Marco's ex, um, who we did hear about in Volume 1, but now we get to meet. And she has uh, joined in with The Will, and The Will, if you remember, was a freelance assassin who is hired to find and kill Alana and Marco and bring back Hazel, their daughter, back to the moon planet of Wraith. So Gwendolyn joins the Will in search for Marco and Alana, and we get to know a little bit more about her and her personality. Um, she seems pretty interesting. Um, I can see probably where it went wrong, but I am just really excited to be able to get to meet her and kind of get a sense for maybe why he liked her in the first place. Again, what I loved most about this book was how Alana was just so excited about reading and just wanted to share her, her reading and that these two, Marco and Alana, fell in love over literature. I am gushing. This is it's, it's what I would love to have happen, um, to have someone that you know you can share reading with on that level and just, oh, love books. <laughs> I gave Saga Volume 2 5 out of 5 stars to The Great Read. I would recommend this to anyone who likes any type of space opera, movie, novel, graphic novel form, or anyone who likes romance. Um, this is one of the best graphic novels that I've read in a long time. I, I mean, I don't read many, but um, I'm just really excited for this series. So, let me know down below if you have read this book, if you're reading this series, how do you feel about these stories, um, who is your favorite character thus far. Uh, I tried to make this as spoiler-free as possible, but if I spoiled anything for you, I'm super sorry. So share with me down below what you, th what you thought about the book, and if you think you're going to read the book, please let me know also. I'm just super excited for this reading, and I just want to share it with other people. Bye! Thank you.